Good day, wonderful family. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Thank you for always stopping by. In today's video, I want to share with us a very powerful recipe you can use to attract favor to yourself. You can use to request things from the universe and watch it come to pass. You can equally use this mixture if money doesn't stay in your hands. This mixture can equally be used if people don't give you money. When you ask them, they refuse. Or when you request anything from anybody, the person will disappoint you. This mixture is very powerful to break every spirit of promise and fail and to remove every spirit of reckless spending. Yes, but in case you're tuning in for the first time, you're highly welcome to this wonderful channel. Kindly hit the red subscribe button to make yourself a full member of this family. Like my videos, share my videos. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you, thank you. May God Almighty continue to bless you in all you do. Now, to uh, go ahead on the video, I have with me here my olive oil. This is my olive oil. Okay. This is my olive oil. Another thing I have here is my cinnamon. This is my powder cinnamon. And this is the stick cinnamon. Another thing I have here is an empty container. Then I'll be revealing the last thing we are going to use at the end of the video. Now I want to go ahead and explain to us what you can use this mixture to do in details. Many people complain to me that... They earn a lot of money, but at the end of the month, they cannot account for the money. They don't know what they use their money to do. That is reckless spending. Some people's own is spiritual, while some people's own is they don't spend their money according to the way the money comes. There are people that earns, let me say, $500 in a month, and you see them making budget of $1,000 in a month. The only way you can balance that is by going on deficit, which is by borrowing or by begging or by collecting a collecting salary advance, which is another way of getting loans and, you know, being in debt every time. But if you live within your means, let me assume you earn $500 and you spend like $200 in a month, you'll be left with $300 which goes to your savings. There is no how you will be broke. If you have any financial problem, you'll be able to solve it without borrowing by the grace of God. Another way people you know, involve themselves in this uh, reckless spending is uh, some people's own is spiritual. Some evil people around them are siphoning their money spiritually. Some of them gave money to evil people and they use that money against them. That money will never stay in their hands. They will borrow to eat even when they are on good salary scale. They must always borrow before the end of the month. So whatever, whichever way it is, by the grace of God, after doing this recipe, money will stay in your hands. That is one. And another thing you can use this recipe to do, we are very close to uh, the Christmas period. Most of us will have rich uncles, rich aunties that will come home to celebrate the festive period with us. Some of them will promise to heaven and earth and they will not fulfill it. By the grace of God, after doing this recipe, they are going to fulfill their promise they made to you. Or anybody that can help you, once the person comes in contact with you, the person will be forced to give you that help, to render that help without you know, requesting for anything in return. Some of our ladies are falling victim of you know, getting help and be paying back with their body. But by the grace of God, this recipe will not allow any evil person with evil intention to help you. The person will help you genuinely without requesting anything evil in return. Yes. So if you're ready, I am ready. So the first thing you're going to do is to get an empty container of your type, any type of empty container with a cover. Okay, it must have a lid, a cover. Then you are going to be adding your olive oil. Yes, this is my, you get any kind of olive oil you have. You may not be able to get Goya, any one you have in your locality. Please get that one. You are going to be adding your olive oil here inside this container. Remember that olive oil is a sacred oil. 
okay whenever you want to anoint yourself you only use the olive oil okay in as much as there's other powerful oil but this one is the main known oil for spiritual purpose now you are going to go ahead and pray on the oil before you know using it but if you cannot pray before using it, just get the mixture done then you pray on it charge it with your intention okay but for me i always pray on my spiritual product before i use them yes this one i've opened it before now but i, I let me show you how i charge it when i get it like this i breathe in i you know i hold it bring it close to my nose i breathe in and out three times i charge it by praying i tell god that i breathed it in a good breath into it that whatever they have whoever that have breathed it a bad air let my own neutralize it i cover this oil with the blood of jesus i bless it in the name of the father the son and of the holy spirit this is for christian if you're not a christian go ahead and bless it whichever way or whichever name you believe i'm not against anybody's belief okay so you bless it with whatever name you believe in okay that is this uh, that is that for the olive oil i remember i've turned my olive oil into this container now i'm going ahead to turn to add my cinnamon powder this is my cinnamon powder i'm going to add a little to it okay you can see i've added my cinnamon to it for those that will ask me they have only the stick one can they go ahead and add the stick one please try and get and uh, make it to be in powder form yes that is going to give us the mixture we are looking for so i'm still going to go ahead to add the stick one why i'm adding this for those that will go and buy the already made cinnamon powder in the market that didn't get you know that didn't blend it by themselves they are not sure if actually what they have is cinnamon please go ahead and add just a little piece of cinnamon stick into this mixture my own i blended it so i am very sure it is cinnamon but i'm still going to do it for those that will ask questions that is why i'm adding the stick one now another thing i'm going to add here is honey this is my honey for those that will not get honey if you have sugar you can go ahead and add sugar okay so i'm going to be adding my honey into this mixture this is my honey i'm going to be adding a, a tablespoon of honey okay this is my honey okay i'm going i'm going ahead to add it so I'm now i'm going to give it a good stir okay i'm using my spoon why i'm using my spoon because my finger will not be able to get down into this container yes but if you have a container that your finger can go down you are going to use your commanding finger which is your middle finger you know to stir it very well yes you're going to use your middle finger to stir it very well you can see i'm using my middle finger to stir it very well as i'm stirring it i'm praying i say god almighty as i'm making this mixture i am making it for my favor for attraction for love anybody that any man any woman that is supposed to favor me as I use this mixture, let that person look at me without asking for anything in return. If it's for employment, if you're asking God for employment, you want to submit your CV to a friend, okay, you pray that as you're going to use this mixture, when you're going to submit your CV, that person will not ask you for anything that you cannot be able to do. Because some people may collect money. If you have the money, go ahead and pay. But if it's using your body, I'm against that one, okay? Yes. Then, if it's for maybe your rich uncles that are coming back home, you tell God that as you use this, that let so so people relocate you. Anybody that is supposed to favor you, any man, any woman that is supposed to favor you, let him or her locate you immediately. Now, how you are going to use this? Every morning before you go out, because you don't know where your destiny helper is, your destiny helper may not be the person you're expecting. Okay, so every morning before you go out, just take a little like this and lick it. Okay, as you lick it, say any man, any woman that will come in contact with me must, you know, like me, must hear my voice and listen to me, must give me a listening ear. Then you take a little again like this and rub on your pen. You say your money, your hand will never lack money. That whatever that have been siphoning your money will never be able to assess it again. Anything that is causing this reckless spending in your life, as you apply this mixture, 
you'll be able to account for every kobo that comes into your hands. Do this every morning before you leave your hand. Just take a little lick, take a little rub on your hand and go your way. But the special grace of God, man and woman will favor you. Every office you go, people will give you a listening ear and do exactly what you want them to do. Try out this recipe and come back for your testimony. I've come to the end of today's video. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Bye-bye.